Hello guys, welcome back to my channel VFX Expert. So guys, in this today's class, we are going to see how to use GDEPTH Pass inside new. So in this today's class, we will see different different examples how we can use GDEPTH Pass inside new. So let's start the class here. So now we are inside new here. So now this is actually first examples here. So this is just a multipass EXR file which is included in GDEPTH Pass here. So suppose if you want to check uh, all these layer are passes here then simply just you can use layer context seed just you can connect and just simply just you can check it here so this is actually just a gdf pass so simply just you can see this is even gdf pass here so now if again if you want to double click here then from over this layer drop down just simply just you can check from this drop down here so this is actually depth channel here so now again just select this rgba always just select this rgba from this list here here if you will see so this image and this region actually both are same things here so now here what i have done simply just type separated all these passes whichever actually a uh, each passes or beauty passes here then after this just i have rebuilt over this beauty pass here so now if you will see just select this one press one so and just select this one press two just i am getting same things here after this just we have to create our depth inside this scene using g depth pass then for this just we have to use a jt focus mode inside new so now just select this one and press one now press tab and just take this jt focus mode here now just connect after this you know here now just we are getting a little bit blur here then you will also get over this focal point focal point means on which area you want to focus so simply just suppose i want to focus on this area so simply just we have to select this focal point and just we have to place it here then after this we have to go to this output options here and just we have to select with this focal plane setup here then after you have to also adjust with this depth of field value so now just i am getting these colors here whichever this uh, first green color green colors means this area will be in focus and this red red means a defocus area near to the camera and this blue means actually a defocus area far away the camera here. so now just we have to set up this focal point then after this go to this output options here again just we have to select this result here yes so now just i'm getting this result here so so simply just i've used over this jd focus node and just i've created our depth into over this scene here then same as suppose if you will copy this one here and just connect after this image control v and just connect it here so same result just i'm getting here so now just you can see so both things are same but in this example simply just i've separated over all these render AOP then after this just we have to use about G depth pass but one more important thing here in this layer where just I've connected a jet D focus input so just I'm getting actually this depth channel here same age also just I'm getting here so now select this one press one so same thing just I'm getting here whichever this depth channel here so now again you select this RGB now in this second example just I am going to show you is suppose this output just I am composite on about this 2D background here. So just you can see this is actually background. So now how we can create a depth here using same G depth pass here. So now if you will use same ZD focus node here. So again control C. So this again only for explanations here. Now paste it here. So just double click here. Now suppose if you want to bit increase blur value here or defocus value then simply just you can adjust this blur size here. So suppose if you are making the size 10. So in this entire image just I am getting blur here. Now again if you will click on this output and if you will try to set this focal point. So I am not getting actually all these color separations or you can say our actually green area here. So what is the problem because actually now just you have merged this output on about the 2D background here. So now if you will check in this merge node, so there is actually no depth channel here. That's why just I am not getting any depth here. Again just uh, unplug this one and just move it here. 
so for this what we can do so this is actually a rare examples here but this is just only for explanation so what we have to do so just we have to copy g depth pass from our this multi pass pxr into our this composting here so for this what we have to do so simply just we have to use our copy node here o plus k k for again copy node and just connect b input with this merge now a input just we have to connect with our this original multi pass exam just make it like this so simply just you can see this direct actually a input is coming from our this main multi pass exr file here then after this what we have to do so simply if you will select this one and just double click on this copy node so just copy channel and just select this g depth channel and just convert it into depth path which are again this g depth path here so now if you will select this copy node and press one again now if you will see so just i am getting about this g depth channel which just i copied from our original multi pass exr here so now again have select this rgb a now suppose if you will try to use suppose same node and just connect it here so now again the double click here again go to this focal plane setup so now just i am getting all these things here. so simply as you can see here then after this just you can adjust this value according to requirement and just you can select your focus here now this is just working here now we will select this final result here so this area in focus and this is actually out of focus or uh, defocus here so like this if you want you can just also just create depth into your senior so this is actually another example here so now just i am going to see what third example here so here simply just i have taken over this beauty pass or a diffuse pass here and this is a separate g depth pass so this is not a multi pass exr file now how we can compose it this pass and just we can create depth into over this scene here so now just select this one which is our g depth pass now press one so now press a there is no alpha now if we will press r r means red channel so just i am getting actually depth information in this red channel remember this one now if you will press g i am not getting anything here now if you will press b i am not getting anything here only in red channel just i am getting this depth information here so now this is actually another example so this is our same g depth pass now if you will press one so again if you will press a also there is no alpha now if you will press r so just i am getting depth information in this red channel now if you will press g in g channel also i am getting and press b in blue channel also i am getting so this is actually totally depends on your uh, source from where just you are getting these g depth pass here so both things just we will see how you can compose it here okay so now finally what we have to do so again just we have to create a depth here so for this what we have to use so first we have to copy this uh, depth channel into over this image here then only just we can create depth into over this scene here so for this we have to take a copy node so press k b input just we have to connect this input a input just we have to connect this a now select this one press one so you will see missing input channels means in this image there actually no alpha channels so now press a here just if you will check so there is no alpha channel that's why just i am getting this error here so what i can do and double click so what we just we have to copy this red channels rgb a and this red now yeah, i can just select this rgb a so just here we have to select this red channel and just we have to copy as a depth here so now if you will select this one and press one so now just if you will see so just i am getting this depth channel here so now just you can see it here then after this simply just we can use our again jet defocus node and just connect it here now just uh, select your focal area then again double click here then go to this focal plane setup and this you can select your focus area then adjust this focal plane now again just select this result so this area in focus and this is actually out of focus or uh, defocus here now i feel a little bit adjust this 
black value according to requirement yes or according to needs so just you can see it here and this area in focus okay here now same thing suppose if you want to do it here just to simply control c control v and just connect it here b b input a input now just select this one press one then simply just you can see this focal area and just you can define it here so and the remaining value just you can add here this is just only for explanations here now again just select this result so just i am getting this depth here again this will be same now you can check it here but now if you will double click on this cop node here so again just i have selected this red channel now if you want you can also use this green channel so now i'm getting same result here even if you want to use this blue channel but here just i am converting actually into over this depth pass here remember this one here. so why this is working here because in this actually g depth pass layer just if you will press r i am getting depth information now if you will press g again i am getting depth information in green channel if you will press d so in red green blue in all channels just i am getting actually uh, this depth information so in this copy node simply just you can use this maybe in red or green or blue but actually just i will suggest always use this red channel series okay so this will not create any problem so guys like this simply just you can use g depth pass inside new and just simply just you can create depth into your scene according to your requirements here so guys if you like this video please watch share comment and subscribe my channel if you are still not subscribed my channel so thanks for watching